We are talking millions of dollars here in donations winding up someplace you did not expect. When you donate your car to a car donation charity, it sells the car, keeps a little bit of the money for its own cost, and then gives most of the money to a charity of your choice. That's the way it's supposed to work instead of the other way around. Look here. One of the most frequently asked questions we get at Cars for Causes is, what can I donate? This from the website Cars for Causes. It claims 42% of donations goes to charities. But state investigators disagree, pushing now to shut down a couple of Southern California car donation charities, alleging fraud. A consumer watchdog not surprised. You cannot profit uh, excessively from a charity. That's an abuse of charitable law. That is the California Attorney General Kamala Harris is now targeting two local car donation charities, filing lawsuits against Cars for Causes in Ventura and People's Choice Charities here on Laurel Canyon in North Hollywood. All quiet, no answer at the charity's office. It's second floor suite, all dark, as the state A.G. Harris charges the charity, quote, exploited the goodwill of generous donors by misrepresenting their charitable programs misappropriating donations and incurring excessive administrative costs. The lawsuit alleges 97 percent of donations to People's Choice Charities went to car repairs, towing and advertising, with the very little that's left over going to the actual charity. Whether it's a car or a dollar, uh, you want to make sure that for the uh, tax-deductible contribution, uh, the money's being well spent. No one wants to get ripped off. Reason enough for the Attorney General to recommend you make your donation directly to the charitable organization of your choice. And if you still want to donate your car to one of those car donation charities, do that. But also call your charity and make sure in the end that charity received the money. For now, we're in Hollywood. You know, what, 